Jamie! Jamie has been with us for two months now. Let's take a look at how he's doing. In the last video, Yati shared about Jamie being on a token economy to practice being more ready to learn. And the target behaviors we wanted were to have nice hands, not grabbing materials, coming back to the chair after a task, and also consistent responding to us. We then added on one more criteria which was to initiate the trial by looking at the therapist and also increase the duration he has to work for to 10 tokens each round. So what you're going to see in this next video is his therapist running the token round and within this round she's working on Jamie's sustaining attention longer with an imitation program. A few weeks ago you saw him copying a chain of actions meaning I do one action he copies, I do another action he copies. And now he's able to copy three steps, meaning that I do three actions and then he copies. Okay, your turn. So this works on him tracking and attending to the therapist for a longer duration. His therapist also picks actions that simulate a school setting, where the child might have to copy the teacher to do an art project, or to follow certain exercises in a gym class, or to learn to play certain instruments in a music class. Very good copy. Well done. Nice job, my friend. See? Put the glue, tear the paper, and case. Nice job. Here you go. Now pretend to be a fireman, okay? I want you to copy me, but watch me first. Okay? Watch me first. Copy me. Ah, fire, fire! Shh, shh, shh. Your turn. With his waiting, we have also faded the wait card to naturalize it, and he can wait quietly without grabbing things for over three minutes, both sitting and standing. Oh yeah, but now I want you to wait. I'm gonna get the cutter so that we can cut into different shapes. Okay, let's wait. It's great that his compliance overall with his team of therapists has improved significantly. However, it is essential that this is generalized across everyone. Jamie had a tendency to be compliant with whoever was the teacher of the day. However, if another therapist happened to walk by and told him to do something or asked him a question, he would choose not to comply. So this therapist set up lots of opportunities throughout the session where less familiar adults would join them for a while and issue him certain instructions. Aside from Jamie's learning how to learn skills, a big focus of ours has also been his spontaneous communication. We now expect him to have eye contact across mastered sentences such as requesting for things he wants. And for the master target, Help Me, we started the generalization process with other less familiar adults and also when we are at a distance and he has to come up to us to ask for help. Help 
We also taught him some new replacement language such as I want to play longer, I want to try again, stop it, and these definitely helped his tolerance overall. I want to be longer. Oh, I want to play longer. Good talking to me. Okay, go for it. I want the track good looking. Okay, here you go. Besides making such requests, we have also started working on him asking us some questions such as where is the object or where to keep. Alright, we're all done with the chicken and the egg. May you go keep? Where do we? Where to keep? Good asking. Over there. Okay, before we eat, can you go get a plate for me? Plate. Where's the plate? Ooh, good question. Uh, over here. Ta-da! And as Jamie is a child who loves getting our attention, we taught him to comment on things he saw with the phrase, look blank. So this is a much more appropriate way to get our attention rather than to make certain odd actions or sounds. Look, kind of green. Oh look, it's green underneath. Oh, it must have gotten some pain. In the upcoming weeks, we would also like to get him to direct us to do certain activities. For example, if we were to do his favorite science experiment or to make brownies together. In order to do so, he would need to have a wide repertoire of verbs. So for his language domain, we have been focusing on expanding his vocabulary with lots of verbs and also his teacher's names. Very good. See the boy is reading. I love your hands. Me? What's happening? started knowing barely any expressive words, but look how much he has picked up. Okay, that's good. Love you paying attention. And what's going on here? Hugging. 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 Mm, very good. We've got some Play-Doh. What am I doing? Pressing. You're pressing. You are awesome. Rolling. Rolling, that's right. And, okay, over here. What am I doing? Rolling. Mm, not quite. Can I take a look again? Kiki. Kiki, very good. All done, all done. Hey, can you still remember where is Amalia? Where is she? Yay! You found me! Where's Amalia? There she is! Where's Amalia? There she is! Well done! Love you sitting down nice and then quiet. At the trap. I like that. Hi! Hi, Gina. Hello! Hi, good Hello. looking. But the chart that I like there. With certain verbs such as wiping or coloring versus drawing, he faced certain challenges and this stems from a learning how to learn issue. When we color a picture, he sees us holding some kind of pencil or crayon and rushes to assume that we are drawing before really paying attention to everything. Similarly, when he was learning to describe wiping blank, before he attends to what we are wiping, he already rushes to say wiping hands because that was something he commonly wiped. In the upcoming month, slowing down would definitely be an area we want to look into. The last thing I would like to share with you is Jamie's progress in the play and socialization domains. He has learned to play stop and go, musical chairs, memory game, catch the tail, snap, and what's the time Mr. Wolf, and has also started playing some of these games with his peers. It's really nice to see that he enjoys it just as much with his peers and has also picked up some play comments. There you go. Not the same.
So we'll have another update soon to share with you Jamie's progress at the three-month mark. So I hope you tune in and follow us on Jamie's ABA journey.